Hello, my name is Frances. I'm one of the client success managers here at Aspire. Today, we'll be talking about the full property wizard report. This report is very helpful in order for us to see how profitable a property has been, and we can see all of the opportunities associated to this property. This is a really great report, especially for your account managers, if they're wanting to get an overview of how profitable a property has been. Let's go ahead and dig deeper into the system. Okay. Now once we're in the Aspire system, if we go to our properties module, and if we click on a specific property, we can go ahead and locate from here. If we go to the three dot menu, we're able to see where it says full property wizard. Clicking on that it takes us to the report. Now, something to notice right off the bat is that it's broken down by four areas, which are services, completed work, work in progress, and work backlog. One of the neat things about this report is that we're able to categorize it by the time frame that we'd like. So if you wanted to see last year's um, services tied to this um, property, you're able to do so. Just for the example, we'll leave it to all the time. Now, to start off with services, as we see here, we're able to see all of the services um, for this specific property. This is gonna help us to understand the status of work tickets that need to be either scheduled or completed. It's gonna display as well um, the hours that have already been approved and that still need approval. If we go down to the next section where it says completed work, the completed work section is gonna help us to understand as well the profitability of each property, but by division. This is really gonna be helpful, especially to help us understand gross margin and where we're at. Understanding these labor costs is gonna be really crucial, especially with your completed work section in order to reach your company's goals. As we go to the um, third section, which is work in progress, this is gonna allow us to see the opportunity profitability but for everything that's in production, right? So we want to understand what we have estimated um, in regards to revenue, hours, um, and labor. And the last section here is basically the work backlog. This is going to display everything um, for this property that is still under estimated revenue, hours, cost, and it mentions gross profit and gross margin. So this is really beneficial as well to understand what we um, have in the works and what still needs to be completed. Um, once again, this report here is broken down by these four areas, which a really nice part of this is that it's actually clickable. So if we were to click, for example, let's say on the first um, line here where it says services, maintenance, and where it says promise tickets, this would take us to a list to basically see all of the tickets that we have um, promised versus like almost similar to what we say estimated, right? And we can get a list of all the work tickets associated to all the opportunities tied to this specific property. Just like any part of Aspire, you're able to filter this list um, and make it customizable to your liking. If we go back to the full property wizard, um, once again, um, this list is clickable as well as the, any other areas. I would highly suggest to take a look at this report and to check out our knowledge base in regards um, to each of these areas and more of a thorough breakdown. But I highly recommend you check this out with your client success manager as well. And hopefully it can help you and your team forecast and to see how well we're doing with a specific property. Thank you so much and you have a great rest of your day.